I'm saying on the score and I'm never giving up nah. Yep, this is actually the worst music I have ever heard. If you think you can handle this type of brain rock, keep watching because I'm not paying for your therapy. Do you know what? I don't think we gave Riz Records enough credit for what they do. This is possibly the worst music I have ever heard. This isn't brain rock. This is going to just give you brain poison. Ragatha, and I'm not just a cute little rag doll that you can throw around. Shut up, bitch. I am here to tell you that I am a savage. Wow, do you know what? The animation in these brain rot music videos are actually really good. I hope that sticks throughout. Let's go gambling. Let's watch this one. Discuss song animated. Bro, what, what even is that? I feel like I just got scammed. This really is the meme of can we get McDonald's and your mom says no, there's McDonald's at home and it's just this. Right, welcome back to a brand new video, Game of Virgins. A lot of you have been messaging me on Instagram and Twitter lately to check out a channel known as Benji X Scarlet. A lot of you were saying that he makes the worst brain rot music and Riz Records has some competition. So I checked him out and yeah, I couldn't agree more. His entire channel does consist of him making brain rot music. That's really all you you can say about it, usually consisting of characters of the Inside Out movie, I believe, but we're gonna watch a random one. Let's, uh, let's watch Salem the Skunk Song and let's see what's going on. Oh hell yeah, dude, you know a song is gonna be good when it starts with a fart. Hey look, I really like the instrumentals in this song, but can we just get a few more wet sloppy farts, please? Like, I actually feel violated right now. I just wanted to watch some crappy brain rot music, but instead I clicked on a random video and just watched a skunk fart. Why? And I'm never giving up, nah. I'm saying I'm the skunk and you know I'm not a punk, bro. Do you think there are any kids who are listening to this and thinking that this is really cool? This is good music. There's always been like weird songs on the internet, even from when I was like a young kid. But at the same time, this is like another level of just bad. Yeah, of course, he just had to end the video with a fart there. It wouldn't, it wouldn't have been a good video if he hadn't done that. I've come to the conclusion that this is either Lanky Box's alt account or this is like some pyro cynical alt YouTube channel. I mean, the entire channel is very repetitive. It's a lot of the same theme. Angry Catnap song, Angry Dog Day song, Angry Crafty Corn song. And the music within the videos is very repetitive. I think even calling it music is a stretch. It's just noise. It's brain rot. We also have to talk about this guy's TikTok because it's also just full of brain rot and it's really weird. Take a baby anxiety song. Okay, rate it one out of ten. I mean, I don't really understand what's going on here. This dude just commented from his own account on his own video asking himself if he will make content. He doesn't even try and hide it. He does this on all his videos. But yeah, sure, dude, we'll check out your baby anxiety song and rate it one out of ten. I am Bro, who made these lyrics? Like, these lyrics aren't just bad, that just sounds criminal. Am I the weird one for thinking this? Can somebody in the comments let me know if I'm the weird one for thinking that those lyrics are just a little bit weird? Take an Anxiety X Fear song, okay, you guys asked for it. Who asked for it, my guy? Who? asked you to do this. You asked yourself. Okay, maybe we just got a little bit unlucky with that Salom or Scalum, the stinky skunk fart, whatever that video was. We're just going to watch another one. Crafty Corn Song music video. This one was five months ago. It has 2.4 million views. Let's see if this is any better. My name is Crafty Corn and I will destroy the world. Now my name is Crafty Corn and I will destroy the world. My name is Crafty Corn and I- This has 2.4 million views? How? How does that even happen? Does he actually say anything else in this video other than I am crafty corn? Are you ready on your market set go? Cause I'm so rare with my rhyme and my flow. Yeah, just wait till the crowd goes to and fro. But I don't know if I want some throw yo because
Oh my god, this is actually worse than I thought. At least with Riz Records, they actually had somewhat of a rhythm, despite the fact they were just saying Goon, Gear, Sigma, Ohio. This guy is like the kids bop of brain rot music. He rhymed flow with froyo. W what? Like, this is so bad, I just don't even know what to say. I see a lot of people talking about how the lyrics are often lazy and not very imaginative or creative. I mean, what do you expect? The opening to a song was a skunk farting. I don't think we should be asking for too much, but let's really just go through this one. Inside Out 2 song, Animated. And let's look at the lyrics and break it down. Hi, I'm Joy. Happy to meet you. I'm Sadness and I'm so sad. Wow, those really are some great lyrics. I'm Sadness and I'm so sad. I really don't think kids would even enjoy watching this. If you are over the age of three, you have an idea of just how bad this is. I'm anger and I'm always angry. I'm fear. Ah, I'm disgust. Wait, hang on a minute. Did, did I? What, what just happened then? I'm fear. Ah. I'm anger and I'm always angry. I mean, you just can't get great lyrics like that anymore. And then we just have fear who says I'm fear and then just screams. <laughs> I really don't know if this is AI generated. I almost hope that it is because I hope someone isn't actually using their brain to make lyrics like this. I mean, come on. So we're going to watch this video now. We're going to watch Sad Dog Day Song. A lot of people wanted me to see this video. This is probably the one that was sent to me the most. So we're going to check it out. I'm dog day and I'm just so sad. Why do bad things happen to good people like me? The hey guys, why do bad things happen to me? <laughs> why does he talk like that? What is the message of this music video meant to be? It isn't fair! Life isn't fair! I feel like this is what kids would listen to when their parents tell them to put down their iPad and go outside. I mean, surely this can't get any worse. I'm dog day and I'm sad. I just want to be glad. Bars! My life is just so bad. Bars! Bars! I lost my legs, but that's not all. Bro! <laughs> What are these lyrics? I don't understand as well why are the lyrics so dark and sad yet he's got this like happy rave going on in the background. The guy's lost his fucking legs as well. Let's just give him some slack. I'm just reading the lyrics now and they're absolutely insane. This is like the saddest song I've ever read. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the saddest of them all? Me. <laughs> Life's a battlefield, scars etched in my skin, but every victory short-lived, the losses just begin. <laughs> the losses just begin. Ah! Something that I noticed on this channel is that they, they like to do a lot of rap battles, but it's like the most random kind of rap battles. You have Joy versus Anxiety rap battle. You've got Dog Day versus Dog Pressed rap battle. But then you have this absolutely demonic one of Catnap versus Skibbity Toilet rap battle. And if you thought the lyrics were bad in any of the other videos I've shown you, oh boy, you are in for it. Skibbity Toilet rap battle, who will win? Comment your answer in three, two, one! I know you might be thinking, oh, there's no way it can get worse. It does get worse. I don't think I have ever heard lyrics this bad before. I really hope kids aren't going into school saying, yo, did you see that new Skibbity Toilet versus Catnap rap battle? It was fire. The bars when he said, you know that I'm sweet like a cow. You know I like cattle. Cattle, no cattle. <laughs> Bro just ended Skibbity's career. But that is it for today's Brain Rot, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe as it really helps me out. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter and just, yeah, you can enjoy the milk cringe I'll always bring. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I didn't ruin it. I will see you all next time.